Well, losing Game 4 tonight would be not just a huge disappointment for Canucks players and fans. Business owners would be devastated. Many of them have ramped up buying extra inventory heading into this year's playoffs after losing out on last year's run. But as CTV's Aaron Glazier found out today, that may come back to haunt them if the Kings are able to sweep the Canucks in the first round. I have to believe. I'm ingrained to believe. I have no other choice. Sports bar owner Mike Joss could win the title of most dedicated Canucks fan, but deep down he is worried he's about to lose a lot of money. Uh, $25,000, $30,000 in sales per round probably. If the Kings sweep the Canucks tonight, businesses across BC will suffer. Cab drivers, you know, valets, I mean, you know, hotels in Vancouver certainly, restaurants, bars, nightclubs. It's, it's the trickle-down effect is huge. Darcy's Pub says it sees sales increases on food and beverages as much as 50% when the Canucks play. And when planning for a playoff run, spending money to attract customers is a doomed if you do, doomed if you don't scenario. Absolutely, but we had to be prepared. Uh, any business will tell you that last year, by being a few games late, they missed out on some pretty good revenues. Sauce Restaurant is not known for showing hockey, more for high-end cuisine. But this year, it added a big screen. Yeah, we spent a bunch of money, got a big 125-inch projection screen, another screen, um, and we'll see what happens tonight. Sports Traders is another business who has made a big financial commitment. $10,000 worth of jerseys haven't even arrived yet. Perhaps their biggest concerns, those with names and numbers on the back, players who may not even be on the team next year. All we can say is hopefully if we get someone else that they wear number one and we can at least just change the name bar. So. Looking into the crystal puck, this psychic is confident about game four, but warns don't count your Canucks stars just yet. Uh, they will win tonight, but the series they're not going to win. A prediction Be A Fan Entertainment does not put a lot of stock in. This ticket agent has already sold seats to Game 5 if and when the series heads to Vancouver. Yeah, we do a refund in that case, but certainly hopefully we don't go to that road. Sean's favorite movie is Dumb and Dumber. The least you can do is level with me. What are my chances? And he says the Canucks are like Jim Carrey's character, whose odds of dating his dream girl was one in a million. So you're telling me there's a chance. Yeah! Yes, there is a chance. But Vancouver can't lose another game until the next round. They're not going to. Well, let's hope not. Aaron joins us now live. Uh, sporting the old flying skate logo. Now the Canucks are three games to none uh, in the hole, but the fans aren't jumping off the bandwagon, and there is still a chance. Uh, fans and players, Hudson defenseman Kevin Bieksa tweeting today, uh, good regroup for the boys, lots of team bonding, got these guys right where we want them, which I thought was pretty funny, keeping it light, but lots of fans out there today also saying one game at a time, we can get back in this one, and I think everyone in BC has their fingers crossed tonight. I think you're right. Aaron, thank you. You're welcome. Find out at 7.